What's up guys, it's Nikki and Elmer with Eat, Try, Unbox, and we're here with Shara and Ben, and today's my birthday! Okay, so we are trying Omosubi from Sunny Blue. It's a really hot spot, there was a long line of people there, we're here in Santa Monica, and today, right now, we're going to be trying the miso beef Omosubi. It's got instructions on how you're supposed to open it, so you're supposed to pull this red thing first, just like that, and then you kind of pull off the sides, you can see, ta-da! So this is what it looks like, and I am going to take my first bite. It's good. <laughs> I beat your first bite. I just like... It's extremely good. I love it. It's very savory. got puri cafe on top, the miso beef, and um, I wish it was more beef. I wish it was a little bit more beef because it looks like it's about 25% beef, 75% rice, but it's still really good. Yeah, it's really, really good. Super savory, um, miso beef flavor. Tastes really, really good. Ben, what do you think? I think it's amazing. <laughs> <laughs> Dexter. This is the burnt coffee. It also has like bonito flakes as well to give it a little bit more flavor. All right, Just so we're moving on to the Tokyo one. Tori. I don't know what's inside this one. I can't really remember. I think it's teriyaki or something. No, just they might have teriyaki. I'm not sure. I think every single um, omasubi comes with a different uh, kind of burnt coffee on top. It depends like what's complimentary. Because this one doesn't look like it has bonito flakes on. it. So it's a little it's got some spice to it. I'm not sure. What's all in it? It looks like it's got chicken, ginger. What do you want? Is there ginger? Tokyo Tori? Tokyo Tori. Not sure. This is what it looks like. It's a little, <coughs> a little, uh, <laughs> she can't handle the spice. It's a little spicy, but it's not bad. Um, I don't know if I'd buy this one again. I think the miso beef was way more savory and it just, it just tasted a lot better. This yeah. one is kind of, um, on my phone. It's not as good as I want it to be. Yeah, the flavor is similar. It just has um, definitely like a ginger flavor to it, and a different kind of burkaki um, with less bonito flakes. Fuck! I get. I still don't know how to open it. I. It's amazing. Wow! Why do they make this so like easy? No, oh no! <laughs> I was gonna say like complicated for um, for dumb minds <laughs> like mine. Like I definitely like the miso beef better for sure. That was always like the top one to me. Ooh, I like it. I like the spice. Oh. Okay. <laughs> Tokyo Tori. Makes me think of like a name. Oh, it's super gingery. What flavor is Tokyo Tori? Describe what you taste. Oh. Ginger. Yeah, ginger and chicken. Ginger and Tori. Anything? That's the chicken? Yeah. Oh, yeah. Is it like some kind of sweet? Sweet and sour? I think it's pretty good. It's like a sweet and sour chicken, and it's all over Dexter too. Miso so mushroom. Miso mushroom. Ah! All right, so next we're reviewing the miso mushroom. It's a meatless option. I wasn't sure if I really wanted to taste this, but I do like mushrooms, so I'm willing to give it a try. I love mushrooms, but I love meat too. Know what I'm saying. <laughs> oh fuck. Nope. I'm not. Mm. I'm not gonna get it right. I have to say I'm not really a fan. Fuck! Um, very sweet tasting. Just biting into mushrooms. Can you help? I'm not sure if I would buy that yeah. again. It is not really savory. Buy it's not again. really anything. It's for me. For me, oh. it's lacking. What do you think? Oh. Yeah, to me, like it needs like more of a. It doesn't. It takes. It doesn't have the savoriness of like the beef, and that's what I kind of like out of these flavors. I don't like it. It's definitely. It definitely tastes like mushrooms. I kind of like the smell. But I think it's just like lacking in like flavor. This is just um, I feel like there could be more with it, like maybe more sauce or I mayo. I don't know what mayo. It just needs more savory. Just something savory, because yeah. it's just like mushrooms. Like Here you go. It. That's kind of it. It was just like way too sweet. It just tastes like that cream of mushroom soup from Gamble's and rice. All right, so I'm gonna open this new flavor that they have. It's the um, pork belly yuzu. I thought it sounded pretty good. I like yuzu flavored things, and I definitely like pork belly. So we're gonna try this out. Ooh, and 
they put the pork belly on top. Bro, it smells hella good. This shit smells really good. Um, definitely the strong juicy smell and like spices. I can tell like this one's about to go crazy. This one's smell. If I knew that that was on the menu, which I didn't, I would have bought one too because I love pork belly. Okay, here, try it. Okay. Um, it's a little spicy. Can I have water? Yeah. <clears throat> Did you yeah. do the curry? It's spicy and it doesn't taste fresh. Yeah, yeah it doesn't. Fine. It's, it's like, not dry. It has it's a little bit of spice. Honey. And I think what I'm like missing out of it is like, uh, it still needs like another like savory, sweet, savory kind of flavor. I think just the flavor doesn't really deliver. Yeah, I think it just needs more sweetness and more savoriness. Thank you. Sunny blue that. curry. Let's see it. <laughs> as big of a bite as I took, I'm getting like zero curry. I can taste it, like I can breathe it, breathe in the curry. No, it tastes like it. I wish it was more curry. But the chicken's good. I think it's chicken. You're supposed to enjoy the food, Shara. Mm. Alright, so Shara has the Cara tuna. I'm opening this for her because she clearly is incapable of doing it herself. Because the tuna is cooked, it tastes like shh. Mm -hmm. I don't like it. Okay. It tastes like a tuna fish sandwich, spicy. Okay. Elmer got these pickled oh. radishes. So I was like eating it um, this whole time. Good. And uh, they're kind of good if you like pickles um, by themselves, but I would prefer to eat them with oh. rice. Oh, I can smell oh, it. Uh, oh, I don't know. Okay. No. Okay. I mean, yeah, if I had some still saved up, I'd probably like put it on top of my other ones, my other um, omisubis. It was pretty good. That's our review on Sunny Blue's omisubis. Honestly, their miso beef is so freaking good, we got more. Yes, so highly recommend the miso um, beef. I definitely, I, okay. I would definitely come to Sunny Blue every time I'm here in Santa Monica just for the miso beef. Um, I would definitely try all the newer ones that they have too, but I don't think anything comes close to the miso beef. Yeah, I agree. I would get the miso beef every time. Like I get like four of them. I literally only like the miso beef. Would you come back? If they put more beef. Okay. Maybe you could order extra beef. Oh yeah, maybe you can Because they make it when you it's oh, made to right, order. Right then and there? It's made to order. Oh cool. Have you guys been to Sunny Blue or have you had omosubis anywhere else? Please let us know because we definitely like to try them out. And don't forget to subscribe to our channel for more things to eat, try, and unbox. Bye! See ya.